Hank, a man is dead, and a couple's on the run. What do you got? First thing to know, Bill, you're in Bucks County, Warwick, Pennsylvania. Nobody gets murdered in Warwick. Not until Thursday. This is the first homicide we've had in Warwick in 27 years. Holy there's only, two, there's only two of us here that remember the last one. Golly, and, and, and you're one of those people? Yes. Who broke the nearly three decade trend? Police say it was this guy, Bill, Jeffrey Ghoul. Ghoul of Ben Salem allegedly put a gun to the head of a romantic rival late last week and pulled the trigger. The victim, Edward Dubinsky, had been seeing Ghoul's girlfriend, Zanatul Naim, also known as Aisha. Neighbors who wouldn't go on camera told me that he heard Aisha screaming for nearly half a minute after the shot rang out. Police add that the pair took off in a champagne-colored Chevy truck. Ghoul is believed to still be armed and very dangerous, and the couple was last known to be in my home state of North Carolina. We have not found the gun. We have to assume that he still has it. And, you know, we, we're charging him with killing one person with it. To me, that if there's not a clear, clearer definition of armed and dangerous uh, than that. Now, though police have not made any arrests, they've already charged Ghoul with the killing since bullet casings found at his Ben Salem apartment match, the one found uh, near Dubinsky's body. Neighbors have told me they're apprehensive about going on camera since Ghoul is still on the loose and some indicated that he might be hooked up, a uh, euphemism for possibly being affiliated with organized crime groups. Uh, you know, he's wanted for homicide and typically those people get found. Flowers in a balloon mark Ed Dubinsky's memory right at his doorstep. Now, neighbors say it's a shame. A friend of the family tells me that Ed was a really good guy and certainly never wanted to look for any trouble. He sure found some, though. What are the cops saying and what's their theory on how this, on, on why? Uh, it's fairly well known that they're together. Police have spoken uh, to sources in North Carolina, people who are said to be friends of the suspect. There are also witnesses who say that after the shot rang out, Ghoul. Uh, sort of forced Asia into the car or the truck rather and that they took off then so they are they treating it like it, it could be a kidnapping or that he wouldn't commit to that okay uh, this is why people think hot people live by another standard than the rest of us because why would she not be charged if she was present at the time that her ex-boyfriend was being killed I mean it, it, being charged is not a conviction they're on the run why is she getting a free pass here Wait, what did the you understanding say? that I have is that uh, no, she that's why, that, this, this is the reason why people think that people yeah. who are hotter get live by a different well, standard wait, than the rest which one is hotter than the rest because some people are commenting on their looks well she's clearly a little the mismatch hot one that like like he's he's out of his league a little bit Clearly, she's the hotter one in the couple. I, I, listen, I'll say this. Fellas, uh, fellas who aren't the best looking but have a, have a roguish panache sometimes have excellent luck with the ladies.